Well, some very important new rules for those who live or work in San Francisco. Starting tomorrow, a new mandatory travel quarantine. Take a look at this map. If you live in the city, here's where you can go freely, basically the entire Bay Area. But if you go outside of those green areas, you are required to quarantine for 10 days when you return to San Francisco. There are some exceptions, though. Here's NBC Bay Area's Christy Smith. At SFO, Maria Malusheva was about to board a plane to Denver. One of her parents just had surgery. Um, I haven't seen them in over a year, and um, I'm just going home because uh, they need the extra help around the house right now. She lives in San Francisco, took precautions, and today learned about the new health order that would require a quarantine period for those returning to the city. I hadn't heard of the quarantine order, but um, knowing that, I'm going to check in with my work and make sure that they're aware of that um, because I have been going into the office occasionally. I know that this is hard. And I know this is yet another sacrifice in almost 10 months into this pandemic. Dr. Grant Colfax, Director of Health in San Francisco, released the order as COVID cases continue to skyrocket and ICU beds dwindle. The travel order will require anyone traveling, moving, or returning to San Francisco from outside the 10 County Bay Area to quarantine for 10 days. It applies to visitors, people moving here, and any returning residents. There are exceptions that include medical professionals, first responders, and essential workers. They're trying to educate people, but say the city can take enforcement steps if the situation demands. And it didn't take long to find those who questioned the quarantine. I don't think much about it. I, I don't agree with it. I don't believe that quarantine has really done a whole lot. One more qualifier, people moving through the airport and not staying in the city are not required to quarantine. In San Francisco, Christy Smith, NBC Bay Area News.